Hey guys, we're getting back at it. <clears throat> I'll be honest, I took a little break for lunch. Had to get something to eat and drink some ice water. Um, so, here's where we're at. We got the four bolts. I'm going to drop this thing down. I'm thinking with my game plan, with the way that this bed slides in, I'm going to get this thing clipped. I'm going to leave those hooked up. Let it sit on the bed. Push the bed in as far as the bed will go. Then just kind of lay it down underneath there. Because the cord should be enough to kind of go around it without putting any strain on it. That's the plan. A lot of times things don't seem to go as planned. So let me uh, climb up here real quick. And uh, we're going to try to take this thing apart. So we got four bolts. One, two. I've loosened that one up. Three, four. Loosen that one up a little bit. I'm going to have to catch this thing when it falls. So I'm going to set this up. Hopefully where you guys can see it. I'm trying to eye this thing down so you guys can kind of see what's going on. Okay. Right about there. Should be good. I'm hoping. Maybe even there. Okay. So, the socket for this thing is a half inch, I believe. Yep, half. My ratchet is worn out. Let's loosen this one up too. Once you get a few turns, it kind of unturns easy. Looks like my styrofoam is going around the where the actual air blows down into the channels on that thing. I might try to come up with a nice little fab fabrication on that. And this one here. And I just noticed, here's your wire clips, right here. I can clip it right. Should be a way to unclip this thing. There we go, come here, let me show you. Come here guys. So mine's right here, you just pull this tab up pop that off there's another one here I'm trying to feel if there's any sort of lock on it there we go those are undone that's good there's the two right there it's right there the top one just pulls out and of course they're shaped a certain way so you can't screw that up let's get back to undoing some bolts here we go I'm trying to line this up where you guys can see there we go just like that hot in here. It's very hot in here. Like miserable hot. <laughs> I don't know how heavy this is because this is my first rodeo with this. Um, like I said, I was trying to avoid any more major repairs on this thing, but it seems like when you have any sort of camper, you're going to be working on it at some point or another. Really need a socket extension. hot in here guys. I'm just undoing screws here. <laughs> That's all I'm doing. Or bolts. There we go, starting to come down a little bit. 
these things are really long threaded so uh you don't really have to worry about just falling out after three or four turns you're gonna be turning this thing for evidently quite some time loose Let's get this one loose over here this one right here coming down I really need an extension. Just the socket is uh, so short up against here. And this is a deep socket, but it's just, you don't have much wiggle room at all. Moving over some to get a better angle on this thing. So I'm wondering if this is going to have to come off. Look here, guys. I'm just seeing this <laughs> we're gonna have to undo this first because when I go to take this off even though it's got holes in it I'm gonna tape around it real good but I'm still gonna undo this here we got to get a Phillips head up in here because uh it's looking to me like this has to come off this is kind of like the air bag that kind of keeps your air from blowing in the unit down so wrong way what the hell all right there we go